um, changing hair colour and intelligent scissors because it like explained it both really. I've got a picture of Paris Hilton here. And what we want to do is you want to zoom in on her. Not that much probably. There we go, that will do. And we want to click on the scissors up here. And basically, it doesn't. You just click near it, and it goes round for you in quite um, a neat way. I think it's better than um, the package tool. But the only problem with it is you can't go back and do Control Z. Once you've done a dot, that's really it. So I'm going to pause the video, and you need to go all the way around the hairline. Okay, so we've done that, and after you've gone round, you want to click somewhere in the middle, and it will um, create the little running effect. Then you want to go to colours, colour balance, and this is where you can have fun because we can make a hair green, orange, bright pink, not so bright pink, um, blue. I mean, like you could obviously do other like normal colours. So I don't know how you get brown on this really. So more um, gingery, reddy colour. It's a bit darker, but I'm gonna go with pink as I always do. And there we go. And then we select none, and there she is. She's got bright pink hair. How lovely! There you go.